Each year, the IRS issues their Dirty Dozen Tax Scams list, and the 2020 information has been released. Some items that appear this year have appeared in prior years as well, and one of the ones that has continued to be a problem is phishing. As you're probably aware, this is when an email is sent to someone hoping that the recipient will click the link and share some of their private information that can then be used for identity theft. Another one that continues to be a problem is seniors being reached out to stating they have a balance due and that they should send gift cards to pay this back. As you know, the IRS should be only contacting you through a letter. So if you have an email or a phone call saying that you have a balance due, generally speaking, this would be fraud. But some of the things that are problems haven't been problems in the past. One of the issues that has arisen is due to the economic impact payments that the IRS issued to families this year through the CARES Act. Fraudulently, people are receiving money because they used information from individuals to file income tax returns, and then they, in turn, receive those payments. Other issues are fraudulent tax returns being filed so that the tax refund is posted into the account of the hacker as well. But some other interesting issues have come across as well because of the coronavirus. Many times, individuals will form fake charities and contact people hoping that the kindness of their hearts will prompt them to issue dollars towards these charities. Unfortunately, many of the ones that are formed are not valid. So be sure to check those who you're going to make a donation to to make sure you're donating to the right charity, the one that you intend to support. Also issues that are arising are those who are stating they can help individuals get an offer in compromise with the IRS to help them spread out their tax payments. Unfortunately, there are some unscrupulous people who are charging high fees even if they know they cannot help someone. So be sure to check with the IRS to see if you would qualify before paying someone to help you with these. Again, there's a dozen items on the list, so if you want to read all of them, please see my website at www.abandp.com and look for the Dirty Dozen list for 2020. If you have questions, you can also reach us at 310-534-5577 or contact at abandp.com. Remember, keep your information safe. Don't click on any links or share any private information unless you know specifically that you are supposedly needing to give that information and you are talking to the actual agency that needs the information.